We we'll have some questions in a bit of fun, and it's two minutes and a, a minute add on. Okay. The first question is: Do you like your name, Anne Bracken? Thank you for the talk, Peter. I didn't like my name when I was at school okay. because there were a lot of Anne's and there were also a lot of Mary's, okay. which meant that if you were Anne, they always tagged on your surname, which I thought didn't sound very friendly. If your name was Nicola or Felicity or Dorothy or something else, they just called you by your Christian name. And that really, to me, sounded very friendly and nice. Lovely. But I was always referred to as Anne Burgess. Got the whole thing all the time, and I always felt it sounded very official. So I wasn't mad on it. My name can be spelled two ways. It can be A double N and can be A double N E. Now mine is A double N E. And I must say, I do not like people addressing things to me as A double N. I like the A double N, so I'm quite fussy about that. And there's a pharmacist in one of the chemists in town. Now, she knows that my name is A double N E. What does she call me? Every time I go in for a prescription, being very friendly, actually, she nearly falls over the counter and she calls me Annie. <laughs> and I really want to say to her, you know, I'm not Annie. A double N E is also. <laughs> so you're stuck with your name, aren't you, Peter? Of course, you're stuck. With and um, at this stage of my life, I've come to terms with it. And of course, for years and years, I was called Mrs. Bracken. That's right. Yeah. Uh, and I'm still called Mrs. Bracken Mrs. by Bracken. certain people, but the majority of people call me. That. <laughs> and I'm happy with that. Okay. just point out something to me here, it's very funny. Uh, we have Anne Bracken here on the list, it's A and N, for starters. A and N, and so that's the first mistake of the night. I was born in 1958, and my name is Joe Ring. Right. And the thing was, I went into the 60s with the, the boy called the Beatles. I've heard of him, Yeah, Ringo Starr. I was, I was, I was used to call me Ringo, and I couldn't stand it. Then again, they could have called me Gary Glitterite more than I would have. Most of but uh, no, I, I just, I don't know what it is about the name. I, I just didn't like it. Uh, Ringo Starr, I just didn't like it. It was Paul McCarthy, maybe, or Pauline, maybe, I wouldn't mind it. But Ringo, I didn't like him called Ringo. But I was in school one day, and uh, I remember I was half asleep, and I was, uh, it was a very cross teacher. You know all about cross teachers. <laughs> <laughs> and I remember there were, there, he was reading something, and I was half asleep. And it came to the paragraph where it was, um, uh, it was D U R I N G, and he was called, Jory, and I thought he was calling me to, to, to talk. <laughs> and I didn't know where I was, and I started up, and they were all looking, here was down at the back of the thing, going, uh, the, the paragraph, and I was back, he said, what's your name? Are you all right? <laughs> so that was my episode of my name. Well, <laughs> <laughs> Thank you. I love my name. I love and mainly because I grew up in a house, I have three sisters. One was Anne, A-N-N-E, -N -N -E, and she was insistent on that. The other was Bernadette, and the last one was Julian. Poor old Anne went through life being called Anya. Poor old Bernadette went through life, God rest her, being called Benny, not Bernie, Benny. <laughs> And as for Julia, of course, everybody called her Julie. I was always Liam, and I remember asking my father at one stage, why was I called Liam? Well, your mother wanted to, be, wanted to call you after your grandfather, William Irwin. But he said there was no way he was going to give a child a name like William. Because he said, one of the most important things about a name is you can't play with it, and you shouldn't play with it. And he said, if your name was William, you'd be Willie, and you'd be Will, and you'd be Bill, and you'd be Billy. He said, they won't mess around with me. And it is absolutely true. So yes, I love my name. Yeah, well done,